Hey there sports fans, this is Asia Unite bringing you Monday Night Football Week 9. Last week I predicted that the Seahawks would win 31-14. I was way off. The Seahawks actually won 14-9. I figured that while Sam Bradford was out for the year, Kellen Clemens has been in Brian Schottenheimer's offense for 7 years. So I figured they'd be able to put some points on the board. The Rams ran the ball extremely well and contained the Seahawks offense. The Rams offense just couldn't take advantage of turnovers and great play by their defense. This week, we had the 4-3 Chicago Bears visiting the 5-2 Green Bay Packers. I honestly don't see the Bears winning this game. The Bears at full capacity already had a slim chance of winning, adding to the fact that the Bears will be without Jay Cutler and Lance Briggs. Over the last three years, the Packers are 13-1 against the NFC North. And while anything can happen in the NFL, the Bears' defense will need to force multiple turnovers to have a shot at winning. Caleb Haney can't make any mistakes while at the same time keep up with Aaron Rodgers. The Packers have found a running game led by rookie Eddie Lacy. Through seven games, they're averaging more yards, yards per carry, and touchdowns since Rodgers became the starter. If the Bears do somehow find a way to win, it will be because their defense forces turnovers and Matt Forte has a great game. The Bears will be put in bad situations if the Packers shut down Forte and it forces Haney into predictable downs. I predict that the Packers will win 35-20. I hope you enjoyed my prediction and analysis, and as always, stay classy. Come on. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319. 319.